today I'm going to show you how you can generate QR codes for free using Google Sheets. Now the good news is because we're going to be using a Google Sheet function to generate our QR codes, we can use this technique to create bulk QR codes, something we can't yet do in Excel. Now since Google Sheets is free, it's really easy to set this up once you know the right function you need to get this to work. Let me show you right now. Now I'm going to show you how you can create your QR codes from scratch, but the good news is I'm going to make this file available for you. So all you have to do is click on the link, which is in the description of this video. It's going to create a copy of this file. And all you have to do is put in the link for which you want to create a QR code from. So for example, let's say I want this which is supposed to automatically subscribe you to my channel, which reminds me, in case you aren't subscribed to the channel, consider subscribing. To create a QR code for this, all I have to do is pull down this function, and that's my QR code. Now, you don't have to keep this in Google Sheets, you can copy and paste it into any application you want, even a Microsoft application. Check this out, I'm just gonna copy this, open up PowerPoint, and let's paste this in and I have my QR code. Now, in case you're interested how to set this up from scratch and how the function works, stay with me because we're gonna cover that right now. First thing you need to do is open up your browser, type in sheets.new. This is gonna create a new Google Sheet for you and automatically save it in your drive. Now, if you aren't logged in to your Google account, you need to log in before you do this step. So I'm just gonna create a name for this and you can also move it to any folder you want by clicking on this move icon. Now, next thing I need is the links for which I want to create a QR code from. So I'm just going to paste them in here. Next thing, I need to write my function. Now, there isn't a specific QR function in Google Sheets, but you can use the image function. Inside the image function, you're going to use a URL get request that's going to create your QR codes on the fly. Now, the link that specifies the steps is this one. That's what you need. And I'm going to add that to the description of this video as well. Here's the syntax that we need. This is the root URL. Now, in addition to this, we have some required parameters. So CHT equals QR just means that this specifies a QR code. Then we can define the width and the height of our QR code. And the last required argument is CHL equals data. Now this here, this is your link, the link for which you want to create a QR code from. Next, we have two optional arguments. One defines the output encoding. Now default is UTF-8, but you can change that if you want. And we have the error correction level. Default is low, but you can change that as well if you want. Inside our function, we need to have these required arguments. So I'm just gonna copy them so that I add them to the clipboard. So I'm just highlighting and copying each one. Now let's switch back to Google Sheets and start with our function. The function is the image function. First thing it needs, and the only mandatory argument here is the URL, but this is not the URL that you have. This is the get request URL that we copied before. So I'm just gonna paste that in, in quotation marks. Now remember, we had more required arguments, and we have to add that at the end of the root URL. So I'm just going to bring up my clipboard by using the combination of the Windows key and V. One of the required arguments was CHT equals QR. So I'm just going to select that. Now to add the next required argument, I'm going to use the ampersand to concatenate these together. Let's bring up the clipboard again. Next is CHS equals width and height. Now this is what we need to replace with the width and height that we want. So I'm just going to go with 500 times 500. We need the ampers and again, Windows V to bring up my clipboard. Last is CHL equals data. Now this here is your own URL. So if we were just creating a one-time QR code, I can just hard code this inside the formula. So I'm just going to type in xcl plus.com 
Actually, I don't need the quotation marks here. I just need it at the end because the whole thing is text. Now, when I close the bracket and press enter, I get my QR code in here. Right, let's just make these cells bigger so that we can see the bigger version. Okay, so that's all it takes. You just have to replace this with your own link. Now, of course, it would be great to make this dynamic, especially if you have more than one QR code you want to create. This is where we're going to keep this part separate and connect it with a cell reference. I'm going to go with ampersand and then go to cell B3. This is where I have my link ampersand enter. And now I have a dynamic QR code generator that I can use. Just drag down the function and we get the QR codes pop up in here. Once you have them here, you can create a PDF based on this. You can just copy one or more. So let's say we want both of these. I'm just going to copy these, open up any application that you want. Here, I'm just opening a blank Word document and then press Control V to get them in your Word document. And then you can adjust the size as you see fit. So that's how you can create bulk QR codes for free in Google Sheets. Now, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to hit that thumbs up. And if you're new here and haven't subscribed yet to this channel, consider subscribing so that you can improve your office productivity skills. Thank you for watching and I'm going to see you in the next video.